Hi everybody, Logan with Enduro Engineering here to show you a new product that we have coming out here. It's the Enduro Engineering Lever Grippers. It is a solution to those guys that have been using athletic tape or other sorts of tapes on their levers for extra grip or warmth. So we now have these le lever grippers that are an effective way to just slide over your grip and then have a nice grippy surface on both your clutch lever and your brake lever. We're going to show you how to install your lever grippers. What you'll have in your pack is two of the Enduro Engineering lever grippers. You can see that they have the extra grip with the Xing in here, different than just using a traditional shrink wrap. You'll need a pair of scissors to trim, and then you'll need a heat gun to shrink them to the lever. Okay, you're going to want to take one of your Enduro Engineering lever grippers. We're going to start on the clutch side for this video. You're going to want to hold it up to the lever and kind of see this is a little bit longer than this particular lever, so we're going to want to trim it up so that we get our desired fit. So we're going to want to keep this logo in the center, so we're just going to trim a little bit off of each end instead of a lot off of one end. That way that logo stays centered. I'm going to hold it back up to the lever. Take a little bit more just to get our desired fit. That looks pretty good. So we're going to take the gripper and slide it over the lever. And then we're going to line it up, get it in place. We're going to have the logo sticking towards the grip. That way over time your fingers don't rub off the logo and it stays looking nice. We're going to get it right where we want it. And that looks pretty good. And then the next step, you're going to take your heat gun. You got it on the high setting. And you just slowly heat up the gripper. That way it shrinks right to the lever. You don't want to hold it in the same spot too long, otherwise you'll burn the grip. So just go back and forth slowly, and then make sure you get all the wrinkles and bubbles out. That way it's all smooth, that way it's not going to spin on the lever. And then once you got all those bubbles out, just double check it, and it looks pretty good. And then you just let it cool, and then it's ready to go. Alright, now we're going to move over to the brake lever side. You're going to take the other gripper that you have. Same thing, you're going to hold it up to the lever, being that most brake levers are a little bit shorter than clutch levers nowadays. You're going to trim just a little bit more than you would have on the clutch lever, but just hold it up there to double check and make sure you get the coverage that you want. And then same process, you're going to slide it over the ball, and just like on the clutch lever side, heat it up until it's all smooth, and then you're good to go. Now that you have both your Enduro Engineering lever grippers on both your clutch lever and your brake lever, you're going to have extra traction, especially in the wet or cold conditions, or just year-round for extra grip and better comfort on both your levers. To order yours today, give us a call at 517-393-2421 or visit us at EnduroENG.com.